Maisie. Maisie, no. No, Maisie. Joey, no. Get down. Joey, get down. Get down. It's our driveway, guys. Maisie, get your tail out of the... Three? There's three. I've only got two of them in my... Oh, four. There's three and a fourth just came across yep. the driveway. One, two, three. And there's four. They're looking at us. They're saying, are we safe? Yes, you guys, you are definitely safe. Help yourself. There's plenty of grass here. Eat as much as you want. We're not going to bother you. But all those are full. And we've had birds flying every which Five. way. Five. There's another one in the woods. Six. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's the coolest thing. We never had, well, we might have had deer at the other lot, but we never saw them. But here, yeah, we'll take it. I'm going to. There's another one, seven. So now we've got one who got brave enough to come over by the feeders. Because there's corn and sunflower seeds on the ground from where the birds have been, I think. Chewy, get off my keyboard. Look at that. Hi, guys. We're here. We're here in Bay City. Yeah, and he's got his phone. He doesn't look up very much. Do you? But. So... We're picking up Pete's Class C that he bought, RV. Um, it's got an interesting history. We'll get into more, get into it more later. Um, but he and Bill are working on it, and uh, work is what it needs a lot of, apparently. The engine's good and all that stuff, so it's, you know, good and solid. Bill's got to rebuild part of the, like, the front end over on a Class C. It has that bed area over the cab, which always leaks. So he's got to rebuild all that, And but for the price Pete got it for, he can afford to put quite a bit of work into it. So the big thing is that the engine and all the stuff, all the expensive stuff under there... Apparently is in great shape. Bill's checked it out real well for him before he came out here. And um, all that stuff's in great shape, apparently, or good shape or whatever. Most of it needs to be, most of the work needs to be done in the RV part of it, which doesn't have much in it. He said there's a couple countertops and a bathroom. I haven't been in it yet. The rest has been stripped out because... It used to belong to a shelter, a rescue, humane society, something. Uh, mostly it will be, it is going to be his ham shack where he is going to use his ham radio equipment. It will also be used if he has a event, a ham event, field event. He'll drive out with that. See guys, told you. <laughs> Humane Society of Midland County, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what he bought. <laughs> Isn't this fun? I just love this. Um, we're not right. We're just sitting again. That is pretty funny. Leland's talking to his mom on the phone. Okay, there's the first uh, first glimpse, and I'll yeah, see you sure. later. <laughs> 
Well, looking out the front window, I don't know why that movie RV comes to mind. <laughs> I am not making fun of Pete for buying this because, I mean, it's something that he's wanted, uh, you know, to make up. And it looks longer than I thought it was. It looks a bit longer, so... I don't know how long it is. I don't know. It's going up the ramp inside. I don't know what, um, I haven't been in it yet or anything. I came in, walked Maisie and Leland's out with Chewy. But, um, yeah, I, I, uh, don't know how big it is. Maybe 24? 20? Yeah, 22 would be pushing it. Maybe 24. And uh, I just unpacked the Amazon order, which was two of these for our new tablets. Some of these, which I take to sleep. And some of this, which I mix in with a couple other different kinds in the big big thing over there behind Elliot so and that's uh Maisie doesn't know what's going on out there um he had to dump the tank like I said something that people didn't do and our dump thing is right over there so he dumped the tank so Hope you guys got your week off to a good start, and I'll see you next time. Take care, God bless, and good night.